Hola, roadies. Welcome to the road trip. It is Tuesday. It is February 28th. Um, we are home from work. Um, I, I believe somebody even left a comment a few days ago saying, do we work? How can we travel so much? Yes, we do work. Um, we do get like paid time off at work. So that's how we're able to travel. Um, we've saved up a little bit of PTO and, um, yeah. And plus I don't work on Mondays. So if I want to go away for the weekend, I don't have to use any PTO. <clears throat> really because like like this whole New York trip that we're going on this weekend cost me three hours of PTO because I'm leaving early on Friday and then I already have Monday off so three hours which is nothing um any I oh, I think Trevor yes hi Trevor you commented asking or uh, saying about the drone footage yes it's gonna be amazing Trevor cam I am a little nervous to use the drone because I've heard stories like uh, my friend at work, his brother-in-law had one very similar to mine and he took it out a few weeks ago and it flew away. I probably would cry if mine flew away. So I am just trying to learn it a little better, um, get a little more familiar with it before I use it in a, a real public setting. Um, what else? Charles, you asked how we like li working downtown. We love it. I absolutely love working downtown. Um, we used to work downtown when we worked for the television station, you know, quite a few years ago. So, um, to be back downtown, it is an awesome atmosphere to work in. Um, if you have any other questions, roadies, please leave them in the comment section below. We'll definitely, uh, try to answer them all. But I thought tonight it would be funny to tell you guys a story. That's why Lisa's not here because I told her, I said, no, I'm just going to tell the roadies a story because I find it humorous and you probably will too, but that's to be determined. Okay. <clears throat> so this story involves a boy. <clears throat> we will call him, um, we will call him Jake. Well, I used to work at a grocery store and... Um, he started working there after me and I just thought he was like really good looking and I wanted to like just, you know, talk to him. So I, we were on break together one day and I asked him, or we guys talking about, you know, things like we like do or whatever for fun. And he said he goes to, <clears throat> he goes to Bible study on Wednesday and he really spends a lot of his time there. So I said, oh, okay, well, listen, I grew up Catholic, but I wasn't, it wasn't like, go to Bible study, go to church every Sunday. It was just, you know, that's just how it was. So I tell my friends, I'm like, so Jake um, goes to Bible study. I think I'm going to go to Bible study one time just to, just to go with them. So my friend's like, you're stupid. She was like, you know, you should not do that. Go somewhere where you're going to know something, whatever. So I was like, no, 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 it's fine. It's fine. No, mind you, I'm probably like 17-ish years old. So here I think this is a great idea. So I go to Bible study. The very first time that I went to Bible study, by the way, it was a, a Christian church. And like I said, I grew up Catholic. Um, the very first time I we went to Bible study, um, they had, it was I don't even know if like Bible study is the right way to put it. Maybe like worship group or I don't remember what it was called. But anyways, they were doing like a prayer and this kid was standing like next to me, like, like fell, fell out in the middle of the aisle. So I'm looking like, what's wrong with him? So that was kind of weird. <clears throat> but I like, I, I thought this guy was really good looking. I liked him. So I was just like, I'll get over Jimmy passing out in the, in the aisle. Um, I can get past that. By the way, if you are any major religion or religious, this is not, I'm not trying to be offensive to anybody. I'm just telling you the story the way it happened many, many moons ago. So we went to Bible study for a few times, a few weeks, and he was like, um, I, you know, you want to come to church with me on Sunday? And I was like, sure. You know, yeah, of course. So he picks me up for church on Sunday and... What I did not know, what he failed to mention, now mind you, this is before cell phones, this is, you know, before all that, geez, that makes me old, but before all that, so he had, um, picked me up, he t we go to church, what he did fail to mention is that he likes to sit front row in the church. 
So me, when I when I would go to church, it would be to the back, get my prayer on, go home. I never sat in the front. So we were sitting front, dead center, and the uh, pastor is like doing his sermon, and it gets to the time to be communion. Now, in a Catholic setting, we stand in the line, we each get the Eucharist, we um, eat it right then and there, go back to your seat, say a prayer, done. Well, in this church, <clears throat> we were like standing in a row, and they give you this little like cracker in kind of like a medicine cup, like if you're in the hospital, like the little medicine cups, the little clear ones. So we each get like a little cracker in one of those. So being only known about from the Catholics, I just assumed you at the cookie or cracker and kept on going. So I get my cup. I eat my cookie. Now I'm starting to look around. I'm or my cracker and I'm starting to look around. I'm thinking like everybody still has their cracker. Why is it nobody eating their cracker? So I'm like waiting and I'm looking around. And mind you, this is a clear container. So now I'm like starting to freak out. Like, oh my god, I don't think I'm supposed to eat that yet. What I did not know is that in this Christian church, everybody ate the the cracker together at the same time. I had no idea. We never did that in the in the Catholic Church. We edit. Oh, you know, you took your one, said amen, kept on going, got back to your seat. I had no idea. So now in the front of the thing, and I'm the new person, and I'm thinking like, oh my God, I have now this empty container that I'm holding in my in my you know gripping in my in my hand, and he's looking over, you know, not realizing that I have already ate this. So it comes time, they say a prayer, and it's time to um, eat this little cracker, right? So I did what any normal person would do, roadies. I fake like I picked up this cracker, put it in my mouth, and fake chewed. Yes, I did. I fake chewed it. Roadies, I could not let them know. I couldn't let them know that I already ate it. I'm trying to make a good impression. That would have been that would have made me look like I didn't know what the hell I was doing. But needless to say, we only went out like once or twice after that. Um <coughs> That's Val. <coughs> She's not feeling so swift. Um We only went out like once or twice after that. Uh <laughs> Still to this day, it makes me chuckle every time I think about it because, like, I remember standing there in front of this entire church, and it wasn't like a small little church, it was like a big church. And I was like standing in the middle, and like, oh my god, I was not supposed to eat that. We were supposed to wait till everybody has theirs. Good to know now. Um, Let's just say it was interesting. Um, and then, so I really, I think we only went out maybe like once or twice after that. Um, he was graduating high school and he was going to go do a mission in a different country. And uh, he quit working at the grocery store. So there's that story. Hope you guys liked it, roadies. If you guys want more stories, listen, I'm full of them. You want stories? I could tell you some stories. But... Like, okay, roadies, comment section below, do you like story time? If you do, my next story time will include the singer Pink. If you don't like story time, just say you don't like story time and we will scratch this. All right, roadies, hope you guys had a wonderful Tuesday. Say it with me. Today, I can do anything. Say it, believe it, achieve it, roadies. With that being said, I hope you had a wonderful day. We will see you guys on Thursday.